And today we have a very, very special guest. As you can see, we have... What's up? Mr. Marcus Jordan. Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> Hello, and it's October 18th. We're yes. recording, and it's band day. So alignment. Like really, really alignment. Random. Alignment. Was alignment. Just this was not planned, together. guys. This was it not was planned. Yeah. No, it really wasn't. I just happened to be in LA, and Henny was like, yo, we got the podcast going. If you're here, pull up. And so I pulled up. You pulled up. And we are great. Yeah, real thank one. you so much. <laughs> yeah, we Coco are. really fucks with him, too. I know. Look so. at him. He's got the approval. He can't get him now. Coco's into it. Very good. It's all good. That's oh, funny. I don't think he's messed with anyone that much. No. He yeah. really yeah. hasn't. He really, he really so hasn't. That's what's up. No, my girlfriend, Larsa, has a dog, too. So he's probably smelling the dog. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He gets the vibes. And I'm giving him love. Yeah. He takes all the love. They do. Oh, my God. Uh, okay, so let's get into what we're wearing this week. Henny, let's start with you. Yeah, um, Neapolitan threes. Um, I just always I love like those. these shoes. I think the women's team did a really a good, good job, job on yeah, these. Really and they match the pants perfectly. And party pants. Party, party pants. pants. We party the pants party this pants episode. One. So, um, yeah, I like these shoes a lot. Shout outs to Women's Jordan. That's yes. what's up. Obviously, I came repping Trophy Room ones, <laughs> of you know, course. Brand. and uh, you know, I got some Trophy Room sweats on too. So I came in fully repping. Oh, I love shout it. Shout out okay. to Trophy Room. Yeah, nice. Appreciate that. Um, okay, so I'm wearing 94 black and red ones. Y'all see it. Um, undead stock nice. today randomly. So have Undies a- 94 oh, on yes. a Wednesday. On band day. And then, on band day. Yeah, yeah, and then I found I had the, I've had this shirt. I got it from tra- Tradition in Beverly Center. Years ago, it was a band aid shirt. Never wore it. I had, I knew I had it somewhere packed away. I was like, I got a shirt, yeah. so I had to throw it on. I think it was like, I don't want to get the name wrong, but on the tag, I think it was like Ezra Wine. Wine. Yeah, it's an okay. artist. So okay. I tried to look him up. He hasn't posted anything like this in a long time. But shout out him wherever you are. <laughs> Vintage. Yeah, so it's pretty Vintage. good. Vintage. Finally got to use it. <laughs> All right. Well, today I have on the Nigel Sylvester friends of family, friends and family, friends of family, <laughs> friends of family. Exactly. She, her says bike, bike on the back, bike, bike on Can the I back, finish? bike on the back. Exactly. She ain't like y'all. <laughs> no. She is not like y'all. That's what's up. But yes, I have them on. They're one of my favorite shoes. <laughs> um, and then still going on the spooky themed halloween themed i have a welcome to halloween town shirt on from a disney small shop um and i hope everyone has watched this movie such a classic have you all watched this movie you i have town? i remember halloween town yeah it's a disney movie sure. yeah yeah i love so that's it that's what i got on today Sweet. also before we get started too yes. As well as like following us on all of our social media platforms, Sneak Link Podcast, remember. Because I know we're gonna probably have like new listeners now, yes. you know, mm-hmm. with this episode. Yes. So yes. I kinda wanna reiterate like why we even have this podcast yes. to begin with. Because sure. obviously we're three women here yes. um, ha- having a sneaker podcast. And it was important for us to really like tell our personal like experiences. Um, and journeys through like this sneaker world so that's exactly what you're going to be getting from us if we make you mad or not yes. <laughs> yeah yeah I've been, a, I've been seeing a lot of people press yeah. 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 it's so. not people it's, it's men it's yeah. men <laughs> it's, it's men i didn't want to say but a, a particular <laughs> yeah. type of man yeah. not yeah. all men we have a lot of men who tune in and listen and oh, we, yes. we yeah. appreciate you all that's and so. we have yeah. a man guest so yeah yeah you know we have a lot of dudes who fuck with us heavy but there's a lot of randoms that just yeah real randoms keep trolling for no reason like All it's funny though because they literally wait for our episodes to drop to every, talk shit yeah yes. trust me I, I, I deal with the same yeah, shit. yeah. yeah. haters are everywhere you can't yeah, avoid them. Yeah. You know? but yeah fuck them so. cheers to us though yeah, yes. <laughs> we just another hair. little backstory and i brought some sincoro oh, yeah. too you know, Yo, so shout out shout the tequila. Out. so it's my dad's tequila he did it with five other nba owners it's called sincoro oh. i brought the which NBA is really good by the way today. and so yeah we're gonna sip it it's have a really good time. really good no. guys. i'm exactly. feeling i'm feeling nice yeah and I'm i drink really nice. i drink tequila often and yeah. this is a, it's a really good tequila thank you yeah yeah janelle don't drink janelle even had some and she doesn't drink okay don't drink so i had to do it for the culture exactly. yeah. Yeah. we appreciate that of course. so let's get into our weekly catch-up what did we do this week guys we what did we well do? last week we went to disney oh okay. and, and it was my first time going to disney it was yes. so, yes. how was that yes. you know i had a, i opened trophy room in disney yes. world oh, okay. originally so oh, okay. I love to know, 
Yeah, yeah exactly. Which I want to talk about too. Okay. Okay. I know it's yeah. no longer there. That, that's we'll get, actually really fire. That's so yeah. dope. We'll I didn't know that. that. For sure. That sure. must be a lot of foot traffic. It was, yeah, it was an experience for sure. Because yeah. it was okay. like big business, but we're running yeah. it kind of mom and pop. But it was, it was, uh, I'm glad we launched there. It definitely opened that's, up that's the fire. store oh, to yeah. like a global That's customer, actually sure. genius to be honest. Like that's, that's smart. Yeah. Nah, it was dope. So what do you think of Disney? Man, it was a lot. It was. Um, <laughs> I get overstimulated pretty easily. Yeah. So, right. But I had them with me. Num- just a little bit background between these two. So, like, she's like the queen of Disney. Oh, yeah. Okay. She's like, no, deadass. Oh, she's fire. like the Beyonce of Disney. Okay. Oh, like, oh, she's there all. Like, she, she does great <laughs> cosplay. She went to the Soho House of Disney, and oh, people literally. don't even get in there. She went to Club 33. Have you been to Club 33? Oh, Have yeah, yeah, yeah. She so, went to Club 33. Yeah, for so my for my store, birthday. we had to cater to all the high affinity That's groups. Okay. Oh, sure. They actually made us go through uh, actual, like, training. Like, they call oh. it toots training. And so it's traditions of our town. And oh, then they wow. give you all this Disney history and stuff. And all of my employees had to go through that training. Oh, that's dope. Wow. That's really cool. Yeah, that's crazy. You would have oh loved that. I, hell yeah. You would have loved that. <laughs> what? That's like both of my worlds colliding, yeah. which I love yes. all the time. That's that's can you imagine a, a Jordan thir- Club 33 collab? Mm. That would Yo. be so Yo. Cool. Right. What? And you, you heard it here first. In Club 33. Oh, that'd be... <laughs> You know how exclusive that would be? That, that's oh like my god! exclusive Trust on me. exclusive. Yeah. yeah. Disney would love that. Yeah. That would be yeah. crazy. That. Oh my god. But, okay, but yeah, anyway, so you went to see what you did. But yeah, <laughs> it was my first time. I had Janelle and Elena and Leah. Shout outs to Leah because she actually bought my ticket for a late yeah. birthday gift. So shout outs to Leah. And it was her birthday. And it was, and it was birthday her birthday. Too. So that's like just so nice. Like, I love yeah. Leah. <laughs> but um yeah, I had a lot of fun. It was um like I said a lot. I was tired by the time we yeah. left. Oh yeah. Uh, we uh, walked the lines so, are crazy. Yeah. We walked so much. I wore my Apple Watch and I think it said we did like fifteen thousand steps that day wow. at Disney. Oh, that's like actually we walked not a lot. Bad. I believe that. No, that's a lot. Fifteen hundred. I'm not a big 15, theme park oh, 15, person. Oh, okay. And okay. so when I had the store at Disney, I had a cast member ID. Oh so yeah. Like, like a blue ID. Yeah, 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 exactly. So I could go oh, <laughs> I could go whenever I wanted, but I never went. I literally went one time. You went. When I closed what? the store, we had a seven day grace period to get everything out of the store. Whatever. Oh my god! I literally went once the very last day, and uh, it actually oh rained. I went to Animal Kingdom. Oh, I heard it, it wow. rained yeah. a lot. Oh, oh yeah, it was in Orlando. The yeah, exactly, weather exactly. is yeah. It's crazy. But, uh, yeah, it was. It was. You know, it was cool being there. Yeah. yeah. But have you been to Disneyland? No, nah, I never been to Disneyland. Oh, you gotta go. Oh, you gotta go. You gotta go. Yeah. You gotta go. Well, Disney yeah. World in Orlando was the first one. So it no, this one is. This one is. Yeah, Anaheim is the first one. One, yeah, the, yeah we were, the second one. We were always taught that Disney World was the it's first. Let me find it. Yeah. No, it's oh, the look at her. Met. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm not 100%, but we'll, we'll find out. Let me find Fact out. Fact check me. Y'all Fact Florida me. people are talking about no, yeah, no, uh, we're, Disney we're, World being the we're first. We're telling you the truth because the whole history, like in the 1950s, Walt cleaned out the orange groves in Anaheim. Yeah. And mm-hmm. I, I, I don't want to speak on <laughs> yeah. that. Good. He's I'm like, good. I have a blue badge, but right. whatever. Exactly. He's exactly. like, okay. Exactly. And only used it once. Yeah. Oh, my God. Dang. Okay. But yeah, Crazy. it was your first trip to Disneyland. It was, yes. and I had fun. And, um, well, no, I don't want to say that on, on a microphone. Yeah, uh, no. Uh, yeah, I'm, <laughs> not, I'm not going to say that. Um, <laughs> y'all already know what I was about to say. Yeah. Uh-huh. But um, it was a good time. <laughs> Especially when we went through the Winnie the Pooh tunnel. I'll just say oh, that as a hint. Yeah. Like, okay. it, it was, man. Okay. What okay. a time. Uh, we're going to take you back now. Though. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we got to take you back. Yeah. She said you want SK to be with you. Yeah, I want time. SK yeah. to come with me. This Disney's could. a good time, and the food's really good. So... But I went, yeah, we, I was there that day, and then I went to Disney yesterday for a oh, yeah. boogie bash. I forgot, yeah, y'all. That was, that was fun. Too. It's a big, it's like How, a, it's, it's, it's a Halloween party at Disneyland. It's easy to get to Disney out here then, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's yeah, like, yeah, for yeah. me, with no traffic from here, it's like 35 minutes. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. That's, so, not bad. That's not bad. But I got I got to leave at certain hours, because if I leave after two, then it's like yeah, an trust hour. Trust me, I just... Figured that yeah. out today. Yeah. I know. I, thank, thanks when for I coming in the traffic. When I how far it was, like, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, then that Once traffic, that traffic hit, it's like hours. LA minutes. traffic hit different. I'm it it hits different. It's all good. I know. Right? He's just I know. I know. Coco was vibing with me. I, I like that. Aww. He's getting closer and closer, y'all. Like, he's like. He, like, won't he's let me stop that. Yeah. He's trying to get on the mic. <laughs> I'm dead. He's trying to leave with them. But, yeah, so I did. Oogie Boogie, I dressed up. It was fun. It was my first time dressing up, and I was the Haunted yeah. Mansion maid. It was and really she cute. She was so That's cute. Sick. Yeah, I never. She's usually like the dresser up or the cosplay. Yeah, I'll be there next week. Yeah. Um, so I'll probably talk about it in the next episode cute. or two. 
Um, I'm trying to think of what else happened this past weekend. I know. Usually, have to check we do anything? pictures to yeah. see what I did. I don't think we just besides Disney, we didn't do anything at group activities. We were going to hit that eBay event, but we didn't. We so. didn't. Girls, oh, yeah, skateboards yeah. had an yeah. eBay that they, that they sent invites. Us. Andre. Yeah, <laughs> you. Wait, so yeah. y'all got invited to something? Well, okay, so like yeah. we got, we got, because we had did stuff with eBay like a little over a year ago okay. or so, and we got invites to the skateboarding. It was like a girl eBay event, um, RSVP through this link. So we cool. all did. Well, I don't think you did right away. Yeah, she didn't. RSVP. We I did. never do. <laughs> so yeah. the day of it I'm comes, the late one. and we're talking about going, and she's like, "Wait, I just realized my." Thing is pending. It's I never a got a pending invite, but so. mine said approved. Yeah. Like I oh, was on the approval, list, yeah. so I was like, "That's weird." And I was yeah. like, "Well, I'm not going to show up solo." Like, yeah, I seen Eric so Costin's name on the list. Oh yeah, you did say that. I was like, yeah. oh, you seen whose name on the list? Eric Costin. Costin. Oh, because okay. I mean, he. I think right. is girl skateboards I mean, his thing. Oh, that I don't. It know. might I be, like but he's skateboarding. skateboarding. Yeah, yeah, the skateboarding community. So, but yeah, we didn't end up going to that. But maybe next one. Oh, oh we yes, were, oh, we were at the skate park, the primitive skate park. For Leah's was that? Birthday. Oh, yeah. can that, we talk about that? She said we. Could. Okay, yeah, because it, it was on the block. So <laughs> can we talk? But yeah, we were there for her. Birthday. Yeah, our friend, she skates and stuff, and um, she wanted us to come out after our our episode last week. We went yeah. out um up to is it it's. Primitive. P-Rod. Yeah, it's P Rod Skate Park. No? It's P Rod Skate Park. Yeah. Yes. Oh, no. So yeah. we went up there. Oh, um, so we learned how to. I learned how to kind of skateboard. I learned, I how, learned to, how to kind of I skateboard. Can, it was fun. I can kick, push, and coast. It coax. was fun. There you go. I can't hey. turn yet. <laughs> yeah. And I was just roller skating. But Leah skateboard, so. so we got to do that. That was really fun. It was a good little mm-hmm. night. That's what we did. Okay. To bring in That's her dope. Birthday. I used to yeah. try to skateboard all the time, but I just. I, I tried I in middle school. I could get the ollie down, but I couldn't get any tricks other than that. Yeah. So I just. I got to my inline skates and just kept it there. Okay. You know? oh, come on now. So yeah, we're going to attempt. I told these people I'm going to skateboard across this page one day. And I, <laughs> that's I am. Yeah, that's they give us shit yeah. all the time. Like, if we get any kind of SB release, it's like, do a kickflip. Oh, right. like, like, y'all can't even do a kickflip. Yeah. So, okay. But, okay, did we get any, pi- I mean. Oh, yeah, we I did like get pickups um, today. I had a shoe just come to my door while I haven't been here. But Wait, what? Which one? Yeah. Well, I, uh, delivery. You got, you got your shit delivered already? Not the, the CPFM. Satins? No, oh. not the satins. The um, Those twos what? I was talking about, the pink twos. Oh. Because I really wanted those. Oh. oh. I didn't know you ended up getting I'm them. one of the girls that love pink shoes. Like, right. you can pink it all day. Yeah, I, every, yeah. I, I, I hear this all the time. Like, don't give us pink. Don't give us but pink. There's like, but there's like, okay, like but see like how there's, this, like, this pink it's, is it's subtle. subtle. Yeah. It's and subtle. And it's light. It's exactly. not hot so I like subtle shoes. Subtle pink. So. So that and that. That high, it was like the high two, right? With yeah, the and I think yeah. those twos really were just cute. done. About, there was a, well, um, them fierce pink, fierce pink dunks that just came out. Were they like a hot like pink? Black and like yeah. hot pink. I'm not no. in the hot pink. Mm-hmm. That's not. That's probably not my vibe. High vibes. school me probably would have been into it, maybe, but yeah. I'm no. usually like with pink. I'm probably gonna go Jordan over Nike just because Jordan True. has a better um, just history of just making it more subtle compared yeah. to Nike. That That's makes true. any I don't sense. Think so. I mean, it really? depends on the silhouette though. If we think but about this, but I feel this. like for years we were always like stop pinking it and shrinking it. We were, but True. when you think about like the. Jordan releases that have been pink, and you think about the Nike releases. Like Nike, I think there's, like there's been more Nike it's, pink releases. Yeah, but yeah. the Nike sure. is just so much more like boom in your yeah. face. Like it's pink. You know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Like there's whereas, like, like you see something like this, and it's like just more like subtle. This. So mm-hmm. I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay, so you got those, and then you uh, got yeah, your they just CPFM. came to the door. Yeah, the CPFM. We hit about CPFM it. today too. Yeah. Elena got one. I got one. Damn, Stay tuned for the fits. Yeah. So um, I'm excited about that. That was cool. And then the satin breads came out and like, mm-hmm. I got them on the shock drop, but you guys both got a pair. Yeah, I so got them. I picked my up pair's my coming. pair. Shout and out to Nika. I, I didn't realize it. I was like, did they purposely drop the satin breads because today is band day? And I would about, assume. So I was like, it wasn't really put out there, but I was like, yeah, it makes like they sense. Didn't, they didn't no. promote we that. We didn't realize yeah. it the whole it, time it until, definitely makes sense. until today. We were yeah. like, duh. This <laughs> may, no, it makes perfect sense. I feel like if they promoted that, well, I can't even say that they're sitting. No, because but I, I have seen some sites that are still sitting right now. Oh, yeah. 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 I just feel like sometimes if you overly promote it, then it takes the, the fun out of it. I agree. Like, yeah. you know, and I, I feel agree. Like people, out of the discovery moment. I feel like yeah. if people you know? would have put, like, oh, for Band-Aid or in, like, coincide with Band-Aid, people would have been mad. Band-Aid. But, like, <laughs> Band-Aid. People would have been mad yeah, because it didn't know. have, like, the X or, like, that band. Or some people, oh, yeah. like, you yeah, know, people, exactly. oh, it's not you a the band. Then it's a whole other thing. Yeah. Like this it's, there's always people that are going to say something. Yeah. But, yeah, I just, when I realized the day and the drop, I was like, oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Okay, good job. 
They're fighting over you now. I know these dogs. They're fighting over you. They fucking with me. No, Coco's like no, 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 no. I was here first. Seriously. <laughs> what are you guys doing? They're know. fighting over him. You They're know. literally fighting over I'm him. Dead. They both rock with me. Bubba's, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> so, um, aside from that, did anybody else have you picked anything up? <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah. Nah, what man, I haven't been really shopping for myself. Like, you yeah. know, I do all the buying for trophy rooms. So, okay. like, oh, no. okay. a lot of the ordering and the assortment in trophy room is like stuff I would rock personally okay. as well. Okay. So it's like, that's where I do all my buying these days. Okay. You know? okay. Get Honestly. it to the shop. Yeah. yeah. It's like, get it to the shop and then I'm trying Take to. Take your pick. Yeah. Honestly, I've been, I've been buying other shit right now. I, be, I bought like some suits. And, okay. Uh, okay. Like, I Professional. Wanna, you know, yeah. yeah. You know, I'm on the Classic move. Man. I'm on the go a lot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I got to okay. expand the wardrobe out of shorts. And, I don't, and I don't believe yeah. that. Out of shorts. You know? That makes, sense. that makes sense. Yeah. Okay, so let's get into sneaker news. I feel like there was a lot going on in this last there week. There was so oh, much, so going much. On. Like we were trying to like we we send each other stuff in like a little chat all week of just stuff we see, mm. and there was like so much to cover. Like we really so have to much. narrow it down. Okay. So you said you had seen this, and it was Joe uh, Lapuma. Yeah, Joe Lapuma um, did an interview, and he brought out his uh, sneaker of the year predictions which were um, the Tiffany Air Forces, um, the SB Dunks, excuse me, the X, shit, the SB Fours. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that honestly. The Noctas. What are they? The Noctas. Glides? What are they? Sl- slides? Glides? Slides. Glides. Nothing Nocta deserves Nocta to be on Nocta there. Glides. Oh, so, no shade. <laughs> <laughs> but, <laughs> no, hey. You know, people have, the, the, people yeah. have their preferences. You and know? some Adidas, Samba, collab with kith and or ronnie fag so okay. yeah okay okay yeah shout out joe lapuma though one yeah. time shout you out, know. Shout out to i mean it's diverse i'll give it that very diverse i'm surprised that born and raised wasn't in there i feel like a lot of people yeah. put that born and raised i feel like it deserves yeah, to be on there that, i feel like that sure. jordan four though that as oh for that SB4 sure deserves to be on there mm-hmm. um henny i agree with henny though that doran becker it deserves to be on there doran becker for sure. Was amazing. For sure. yeah for sure what else has come out this year that's been really? I feel like the Tiffany's was was a moment though. I you know, yeah, like, I wouldn't say it's the sneaker of the year, but I feel like it was true. definitely a moment. True, it was a moment. But I feel it like came people wanted the accessories and shit. More. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I, exa- like, I love the little like the Tiffany shoehorn. I want that so bad. Yeah, <laughs> yeah the accessories. Can I use very that nice. with my yeah. nails? Yeah. Shoehorn? Yes, because yeah. my oh. nails. I don't oh, want to break true. a nail putting nah, my shoes on. I thought about actually making shoehorns too. I I have them. And like shoe trees. Yeah, that makes sense. You really should. Yeah, because I and like a travel shoehorn. Like for when I travel, uh, yeah, I've never used that. Yeah, like because have you ever like tried to stick your foot? In oh and you yeah, almost break yeah, a nail? yeah, like, yeah. That's the worst. Shoe- no, that is, is the worst. worst too, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. It's like, yeah. like tight. I was like, that I don't want to unlace all this. <laughs> mm-hmm. on no, road. slides right in. Yep, for real. That's letting you guys know. Invest in a shoehorn. <laughs> <laughs> they do come in handy. So okay. Oh. Sneaker of the year. We'll see. Yeah, we'll when, see. When I do they we'll usually, because I mean, I know Complex does theirs, but well, like. Well, usually they, remember last year he did it at Complex Con when they had that conversation. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And they had like. like a panel yeah, yeah. And it, it, like Vashti was on stage. And um, uh, Clark Kent. Clark uh, Kent was on stage. Uh, um, I, I didn't go to the actual conversation. We were there, I, but I don't I've think we got there. any Complex like, Con panels. Some of the panels be good. Uh, like some of them well, are like, no, because Kendrick decent. and Kobe. Yeah. Oh, but that, that was amazing. Was, yeah. but that was, that was amazing. Yeah. yeah, it was. It was I a was time. on the floor. Oh, okay. Usually the panel's like uh, upstairs or in the room. I remember yes. going True. to one. I just forget what it was for. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I think like the game and like when people were there was mm. like their panel with him on there when you're probably Maybe. this is pre pandemic. I went to one with Lavar Ball and that shit was funny as fuck. What? Yes. I, it was a show, bro. Like <laughs> that man is funny. Like Lavar Ball, if if anything, like he could be a stand up comic. Like <laughs> my guy is joke. Like he That's is big funny. jokes, but yes. That's so oh, on that year we, uh, me and Sean Kelly crashed the Pharrell. Oh, and that's when you yeah, said that. Yeah. So one year that. we went to Complex Con, and my okay. son, he was young. We had like VIP bands, and he he's extra, by the way. Yeah. He's, he's he's a beige rager, but um, <laughs> beige beige rager. Rager. but um, we had walked into this room that we weren't supposed to be in, yeah. and it was like Pharrell, Ambush, uh, Takashi Murakami, like right. random people. And 
My son doesn't know who any of these people are, by the way. Yeah. Like, my son doesn't <laughs> care. Okay. But he saw Takashi Marikami, like, dressed up in his, like, yeah, outfit. He, yeah, exactly. And he was he like... The, did he have the octopus on his head that year? Yes, he or, had the big yeah, octopus. I love that. So, like, my son just randomly walks up to him and was like, take a picture with me. <laughs> and like, he's, like, looking at him like, what? Because, you know, he barely understands English because yeah, he always has a translator. Yeah. Yeah. Um, translator but then I think he got the picture. So, like, I went over there and I took the picture and then Sean Kelly was just like holding his hand the whole night. Like the whole, yes. the rest of the time we were in there, then they had to go on stage to the conversation. Sean yeah. Kelly's holding this man's hand, no walking way. out. And I'm like, that's hilarious. And I'm like, this is my child. Up I on didn't stage know that this man. That's, like, and I know going. people are like, who is this? Who is this, this baby child? child? Like, yeah, he's who does he belong to? Who is this? Yeah. But yeah, good times. That's so funny. Oh, okay. Yes. So, um, I think it came out Shaq and Allen Iverson were announced president and vice president of Reebok basketball. Did y'all see really Old Girl cool. got signed too? Uh, Angel Reese? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 Good, for her. Her. Good yeah. for her. I think Shaq, because he went to LSU. Kind oh, of that makes sense. That does make okay. sense. Okay. Yeah. Sense. I love that. Good Making moves her. already. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he said, we're going to get her. Yeah, that's dope though. Yeah. No, that's so I love seeing that. That was the news this week. Just had to mention it. Mm -hmm. um, I hope we get some more new questions. Oh, yeah. Yeah, questions are always good. You do be rare Reebok. Oh, yeah, I love Yeah, you love Reebok. Okay. Cute. Uh, what's next? Oh yeah, Supreme has. Do the air? Okay, so the air Darwins. Do they come out this week? Tomorrow, like tomorrow, or when do the? It's the court posits that are coming out. Okay, oh, of course I know. Like the images. Wait a minute. In, the air the Darwin air, is that is that, is that um, skateboard that looking, old shoe? Yeah, um, and, and it's for yeah. yes, yes. Yeah, that, which is black. clean by the that, way. Those images surface, and then the court posit. I don't is think out that too. air Darwins has a day yet. I don't think. I think those are just like leaked pictures. Yeah, it's just a leak. Yeah, because they were like, this is like a skateboard edition. What y'all think about those? I love those. I like the color a lot, and I like the way it looks. It wouldn't even need the Supreme tag for me. I would wear it without the Supreme tag. I think that colorway is crazy. It reminds me of the 90s, like, you know what I'm saying? That like denim look. Like, I love it. It reminds me of like Martin. Like something Martin would have on, like in an episode or something. I love that shoe. I'm watching that show back right now, actually. Martin? Mm-hmm. If I could pull it up, because here's the I feel like court Martin posit. Martin is always a good watch. Yeah, mm -hmm. we're going. Oh through, yeah, like, so the court the posit drops and just, tomorrow. Just to see what he got on. Like, yeah, it's always yes. like, yeah, even Cole. Cole's outfits yeah. oh, were crazy yeah. on there too. Yeah. yeah. All of them were pretty fly. Yeah, yeah those was kind of tough. Yeah, spring, Bro, summer, 2024, and the backwards swoosh. So everyone was talking about uh, that. Too. That shit, yeah. fire. I didn't yeah. notice that. But that, it has like the SB tag. With Bruh. the cream. Those are I, that's fire. Like, yeah, I like the material. I like that material. Yeah, I want to see how those hold up with a skateboard. Oh, it's yeah. true. Spring, summer, Yeah, next 2024. Year. I would okay. like to know who the color designer was on this one, because yeah. they did. Look, they was Nate Duffy yeah. on that. Mm -hmm. like, yeah, they kind of tough. They, those are nice. That was and you know there's going to be probably, like, two other colorways, too. So I'm interested yeah. to see, like, what those colorways even look like. They always do a three for... Those decent, those decent <laughs> too. Those yeah, come out this week, true. no? Yeah. Tomorrow. 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 These come out yeah. tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, Supreme, the court pauses. There's the I think black, I like the green pair the best. Black, yeah, the green for sure. Black, white, and then the green. I think, I think the, those are my favorite. I think for wearability, I fuck with the white ones. Just the white ones okay. match they go a lot. With, it'll go like that. Everything. Gray, yeah. True. I love the, the red true. accent swoosh. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. But the green stand out. For sure. Yeah. Yeah. The black is giving triple black Air Forces to me. Like, yeah, the black is <laughs> yeah. a little she problematic hates, for me. If you're about to rob somebody. Black, she yeah. hates, she hates yeah, she hates black yeah. shoes. Yeah. I, I agree. Yeah, that shoe that's not for me. I feel like this is a New York shoe. For sure. Yeah. yeah. Sort of. I, don't see, I don't know if I can see people out here. No. Right? DC too, because yeah. DC fucked with yeah. like phone posits heavy. So anything posit, period. Oh, yeah. 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 It's just um, giving like baggy vintage. Like, yeah. Like, yes. like 90s vibes. It's definitely vintage. Girl, it's yeah. definitely yeah. like, yeah. You know. That moment. But it's decent. They're cool. Right, mm -hmm. I'm not mad at them. I'm not going for them, but like it's hard to get Supreme in my size anyways. So. Yeah, yeah. They don't even come in small they, sizes at they all. They do, but they, they trickle down after the release. Like they'll pop yeah. up in random places mm. in small sizes. It's the stupidest shit. But you know. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Um uh, the Adidas clots, like Oh yeah. Yo, if I wore Adidas, like this would be this would be a, a, a big look messages, for me. Where are they? It's in our I think it's in our messages. Coco. They did a whole like um Oh yeah, like we fashion. didn't have this on the note, but I'm gonna mention this since we're coming across it. Did you see the Dave Chappelle? Oh, those is tough. Oh, I yeah, did. Because yeah, you mentioned DJ Clark Kent a second ago and that oh, it popped okay, in my okay. mind. Yeah. yeah so wait, fire. this is official? Oh, I think it. it was like a friends and family. I think they thing. did five pairs just for oh, Dave. See? So yeah. it's like a catalyst yeah. type of thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, those is tough. Oh, for his Netflix special. I think what happened was they searched down. Like the white and gum bottom. That gum bottom. I love oh, the gum bottom. And they got, oh, got, they got their hands on five pairs and then they threw got Dave's logo on. That's those, fire. Those are okay. 
Yeah. yeah. I, I saw like Dave it. in Madison that. Square Garden, too, with Larsa. And, oh, uh, nice. It was hilarious. He was filming a Netflix special for his 50th birthday. Oh, that's and, dope. Yeah, it was, it was fire. I bet. When did, fire. I think I seen him in November last year. He was out here in At Anaheim. The, oh, okay. Yeah, that yeah. was a good show. I love I that he, Hollywood he makes you, like, lock up your phones and yeah, stuff. Yeah, exactly. So no one can read a Yeah. Nope. For sure. It's really dope. Shout out, Dave. Awesome. My boyfriend yeah. watched him um, last year, too, during one of his specials, and he locked up his phone, but he didn't tell me that he was already going to the show. Oh, and I was shit. like, dude, what the fuck? Uh, like, yeah. how you was tripping. You were sure tripping. tripping. Gotta, gotta get you in trouble. Oh, right. yeah. <laughs> so, like, when I had went, my thing didn't lock, and I didn't pull my phone out to record anything, but right at the end, I got a clip of, um, oh, my God, what's his name? The one that says, I'm a rich bitch at the end of Chappelle. The I little can, dark skin, uh, 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 body locks. That's still uh, with him. Oh, man. I know you're talking about. Yes. I know you're talking about. So they were all on stage, and I pulled out my phone right at the very end, and he said that, and I got Donnell that clip. Rawlings. Yes, Donnell thank Rawlings. you. Yep. I got him on the mic saying that when the show ended, and I was like, Ugh, "Wow, I, sneak a little. I know." But I was like, <laughs> "But it didn't lock," so I was like, oh, mm. "Man." But um, okay, so I was looking for the pictures of the cloud. Oh, yeah, Sorry, yeah, the cloud Adidas. Um, mm. That looked. I sent it to the chat. Actually, that I actually, I actually really like them. I might. You know, I've never worn Adidas in my life. Wow, well, oh, well, that well, makes sense. Uh, uh, well, no, I, was I remember say. there was like a story, like when you were in college. Yeah, so yeah. When I went to UCF, they were in Adidas school, but mm-hmm. the team, you know, the coaches that recruited me always told me I didn't have to wear Adidas. Right. And so oh. when I got there, I guess the higher ups in Germany had an issue with it or whatever, and you know, the school didn't want to go back on their word right. to me. So. It was an issue for a minute, but, you know, Nike stepped in, saved And the did your thing, yeah. Away. Exactly. Exactly. That's crazy. I love when things just work oh, out. Oh, right here. Yeah, I think. Are they so, so, No, they those did. are. Uh, I think the top is a Samba, and then the no? bottom is. Oh, or um, looks like a. Um, or no, or that's the Samba. They all look the same to I me. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I, mean, I love because there's like the samba, the gazelle, the stance, the superstars. Smith, they, super also, stars, they all look the same. I can't tell us the difference. Is, they do look, look the same. It looked like they mixed a few silhouettes. Yeah, together. it looks like okay, they like so kind of fused like stuff. I, I never like remember the them having that. Out, but yeah. I'm not, I like the concept behind them. Like it's giving them that, a new like the dress like, shoe. Yeah, like kind of wingtip. Vibe. Yeah, yeah. What are these? I like that little like the Japanese writing. That's kind of fire. I, I, fuck, I fuck with clap, but I, don't, I do too. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't I do too. Adidas. Yeah. So okay. We don't I'm blame 50, you. 50 on you. <laughs> yeah. I feel He's you. Like, damn. like yeah. one side of the collab, not the other. Exactly. Um. Oh, so that we talked about. You got the CPFMs. Yeah. Um, but the rollout was really cool. They did all those claymation. I love the claymation. Yeah. That was so yeah. Funny. yeah that was it was, was so really, fire. Was one of them like a LeBron? Claymation? Yeah. One yeah. of them is a LeBron. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. That was kind of funny. Yeah. I didn't really understand what was going on. It's like, I think it's actually rooted from something older. I think okay. it's from something else. I want to go find the reference, but I was okay. talking with somebody earlier, and they said that it was like rooted from something that had came out a long time ago. Oh, so I'm gonna find that reference. Yeah, someone let us know. I want to figure it out. Yeah. Um, okay, so then we had talked about these a few weeks ago. The Paris Govell Dunks. Mm-hmm. They Rihanna's was, choreographer. Yes, they did like a early drop this week on Nike, but the official drop is October twenty fourth. So I think like I seen the homegirl Nay. She, I think she posted. She, she got them. everything, man. I swear she really did. It's just man. a regular dunk though. It's not a SK. No, yeah, yeah. It's, that's why it was like on Nike. It wasn't even on sneakers. It's a quick strike, so yeah. I think it's that, that'll be available to like just like right regular like neighborhood stores and stuff. Yeah, like it'll okay. be like accessible. Not tier, mad at it. Tier yeah. zeros, mm-hmm. oh, but they don't even have. Well, they don't have tiers anymore. anymore yeah. But like it's just like neighborhood, mm-hmm. and like if you have a good Nike account, like you'll probably you'll have them. access to that. And I feel like, I like the way that shoe is, it, I see it'll be a lot. Room. So is it, a, is it like a satin? Was that what's on it? Yeah. Um, it, like it, it, it was, there was a satin. There was like a patent leather. And then there was yeah, like a so different kind of lace. Material. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. then they had like little um, accessories like um, for the laces. Ooh. Oh, the. It, the what's it called? Like the the eyelids? Charms? Yeah, the charms. Like, okay. Yeah, the charms. Yeah. Interesting. So, I mean. I want to see them on cool. feet. Okay. I do want to see them in person. And then. I want to see them in person too. Yeah. Cause they look a little childish, but then a part of it, a part <laughs> of it like, is like kind of fire. It's that yeah. type of pink we were just talking about. Yeah, that like, where it's like that, I don't know. Yeah. It's like mm, it's the color blocking. With pretty the pink. bright. Yeah, yeah. it's and giving I, eighth grade. I don't know. <laughs> that's, like, that's why I said I was like that type of shoe. I would like yeah. totally in high school. I would love it. Yeah, you know? like yeah, but for me sure. at this age, like. <laughs> 
I'm I can definitely see him at my son's school when I drop him off every day. Yeah, like, I like agree. just like kind of like walking. You feel I me? Agree. Yeah, but I'm not mad at him. Okay, I'm not mad either. We support yeah. Paris, but I would she like keep... to see if she has anything else upcoming. Yeah, yeah. I wonder if there's apparel with it, like the stuff that she was wearing. I would hope they wouldn't the... waste it, yeah. waste the opportunity because I feel like she could have really good apparel. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, and she can dance her ass off. She so really can. Imagine yeah. like her the campaign and stuff. So yeah, I love her shit. She did the uh, the Super Bowl. Yeah, she choreographed that whole Super Bowl performance. She's done a lot of really good events like yeah. big big things she's really known um and then this kind of hit the blogs today that we can ask you about um <laughs> so the leak of the week yeah, yeah. so leak of leak. the week <laughs> one low? i know leaks yeah? these leaks are undefeated yeah. <laughs> I swear. can we get a um, confirmation right so oh. there is a one low in the works <laughs> okay. i will say that Okay. Um, okay. A lot of information that was on that leak is inaccurate. Okay, okay. okay. You know, as it always is. Um, okay, I won't, okay. I don't. You know. Yeah. Unfortunately, I can't set the record straight right <laughs> okay. now. Okay. okay. But you know, it's it's on the way. It's on the way. Okay. And okay. we're gonna need small size extended sizing. It will be it will be a takedown to size men's four. Yeah. 100%. Okay. Well, so, just in case you need to know, five, yeah. six, seven. <laughs> exactly. I'm just yeah, saying. Look, that was one of the things. That was one of the things that we didn't do on the one on the freeze out. We know, mm-hmm. and so yeah. we're exactly. aware. <laughs> but the sevens, the sevens went down to four. We dropped the sevens too. Oh, that's okay. true. No, you did have the sevens. A seven. The sevens you was gray right. school. Well, not gray school. What about and the fives? Was it, was I know the fives. No, the fives. <laughs> no, no, no. The sevens, oh. the sevens came out online. That no, was but the right fives. Before. The fives, they weren't friends and family. Oh, we okay. had a friends and family Oh, that's pair. what it was. Okay. okay. That's okay. what I was thinking of. And, okay. And I don't want to give too much out of the bag, but there might be two colorways okay. of the AJ1 look. Oh. That's okay. all I can say. Okay. That's, okay. Get the rest you heard it here. You heard it here. Okay. There okay. might be. There might be. <laughs> there might be. Well, we're, we're, see, we're excited for that. You we, know? Are. we are. We are. Especially we can get mm-hmm. our size. Yes. That would be lovely. It's a sick story. Like, for me, when I create... I always want the story to be authentic and to connect back to my pops yeah. in some sort of way. Yeah. And obviously put our spin on it or you yeah. know, perspective. So mm-hmm. I mean that's know, something this we've is talked another one about on, often. On, yeah, this yeah. is another one on that cadence. So Yeah, okay. we talk about storytelling yeah. a lot because I feel yeah. like sometimes it's a loss. It's important. It I is. I feel like what kind of spawned shoes. what spawned Trophy Room was like I felt like, you know, collaborations with Jordan Brand were getting so far removed from mm-hmm. my dad. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Agreed. Like, yo, you know, let's, Points are made. let's start something to connect the dots. Yeah, you know? so. I love that. I think that's important, though, like especially like y'all being a neighborhood store yep. and being able to bring that kind of energy because you do see a lot of collaborations, like even like what I have on. So like well, not a collaboration, but just like regular GRs. Like yeah. it's cool for women's like it's a nice like cool colorway or whatever but like there's no story they there's no story Mm -hmm. and then also we're just getting so far away from anything that's retro or anything that Mm -hmm. like we actually like grew up on yeah Yeah. and i get it like what they're trying to do because there's certain you know like generations we're catering to now yeah but at the same time you have plenty of older Gen Zers, millennials, and even boomers who are still avid, like, sneaker, like, consumers. Mm -hmm. And you have to cater to that. And sometimes I feel like a lot of brands just get so fixated on trying to, like, cater to the next coming generation that they miss out on a lot of shit. And then they're wondering why numbers are down Mm -hmm. or whatever the fuck else. You know what I'm saying? What happens a lot is that there will be a story that that tells, I mean, that, they're trying to tell through the shoe, mm-hmm. and then they do a bad job of passing it on to us as the retailers to help. True. Oh, yeah, absolutely. So, and so they'll be like, look, we cooked this shoe, and then here you go. Yeah, do and it's something like, all right, well, yeah. we can cook things in our own way, too, but, you know, some assets would be helpful from time to time or just 100%. assistance, you know. Yeah. But, you know, not that I'm asking for that, but I feel <laughs> like that's the overall consensus from, from the neighborhood doors, you know. Yeah. Yeah, that makes complete sense. Uh, I agree. And I think the consumer would agree too. Oh yeah. I mean, we are. Yeah. We Mm -hmm. talked about it. Like with the eBay, we touched base on that eBay campaign, like Mm -hmm. um, catering to the younger crowd. And we were like, this would have hit so much better with the older generation because we fuck with eBay. So not so much more. I know the younger crowd, does eBay shit too, but like yeah. that was really like our source. For we sneakers. grew up yeah. on we grew it up in that up. time. It was like 10, 15 years too late. Yeah. yeah. So we're just like, it was our stock X and go. Yeah. It was yeah. without exactly. being a stock X or go. Yeah. You know what I mean? 1000% yeah. before there was like people checking for like what, Authenticity. 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 Yeah. 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 But yeah, but. exactly. Before that even came along and you were taking those risks. So it's like certain things like that. They really miss everybody on Nike talk had an eBay account. That's how they were selling. Oh, yeah. Like, 1, period. Right. Like, yeah. 
But okay, so then the other thing we want to heard rumors about a possible Vegas <laughs> store. Yeah, Coco <laughs> 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 heard Vegas the rumors too. Yeah, like, exactly. Tell us. Yeah, so look, you yeah. know there was an opportunity in Vegas uh, at the Fountain Blue. We were looking at it. Ooh. I don't think it's gonna happen. Okay, okay. Um, but. There is an additional expansion of Trophy Room that's in the works. Oh, okay. I, on the West Coast? Yeah, is it towards it's, us? It's not on the West Coast <laughs> okay. yet. It's not on the West Coast Is it yet. in the same state where you are? Or I, is can, it I cannot <laughs> confirm or deny. <laughs> you know, but well, it's, it's in the works. It's that's in the works. Okay. Well, works. Okay. we'll be on the lookout. Yeah, Second yeah. store coming soon. Yeah, nice. Coming soon. And sure. then, so usually we do our soul searching segment where we di- dive deeper into whatever we're talking about. And of course, we have you on today. So we cool. wanted to just ask you some questions. Let's I think it. you kind of answered this semi a little bit when you were talking a bit ago about your, in, you know, you draw stuff from like your dad and things yeah. and bringing the story, but like, where else do you get your inspiration from? Um, honestly, I just, you know, I grew up in sneaker culture. Yeah. yeah. Naturally. And so it's yeah. just like, it's all around me. But I think what started trophy room was really that trying to cater to the void of s- collaborations being authentically tied to my dad, you know? Yeah. And so, yeah. I feel like I offer a unique perspective into his legacy. And so we try to, you know, do his legacy justice mm-hmm. by telling the stories that we tell. So okay. that's okay. kind of where it comes from. Okay. Can I have some more tequila? Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Can like, you feel like, that? Like, like, no. I brought this for, I brought this okay. for everybody. Yeah, I was exactly. like sitting here. I was like, should it's I ask? Or? Janine, are you getting seconds? No, I brought oh, iron. Oh, I thought that was this. This is just ice. Just okay, my bad, my bad. Oh, One and done. You know, my eye be on you, girl. My eye be on you. Go ahead. No, you got it. You got it. I am weak. Uh, sorry, good. guys. Yeah, you good? Throw me a couple cubes. No. Yeah, let me get some cubes, right. too, because I think I'm good. Right. It's all watered down. No, it's, it's all good. The water helps. Yeah, it does. It kind of helps you take know. it down. Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. Elena, I love how prepared you are with that ice on the sun. I thought about it before we sat down. I was like, let me Thank get you. some ice. Because <laughs> I know I'm going to be... Coco. Coco's trying Coco, to you're not getting none, bro. You can't get a sip, Coco. You're not 21. I'm <laughs> dead. He, Maybe in dog I think his... No, is he's next year. Oh. Next year. I think he's like See? 14. We on you. Okay, so um, next question. How would you describe your personal style? Uh, that's a great question. Yeah. I think, um, you know, I lead... Because I feel like my personal style is always evolving. Mm. I feel like that's most true. People, you know, true. Oh, so yeah, for sure. Same. I lead through athletic athleisure, you mm-hmm. know, so Jordan and sportswear and, you know, I'm a hooper at heart. Okay. You know? And then, you know, I, I, I wear a lot of streetwear stuff, you know, I'm Same. mainly a streetwear dude, but now I'm, you know, like I said, I'm on the go. So I'm trying to elevate my, my style. So I've been doing a lot of custom suits oh. and tailoring yeah. and blah, 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 okay. blah. But, you know, put obviously, that shit I on. still wear sweats, yeah. trophy room right. sweats. Yeah. You know, I, I do all the designing for trophy rooms. So, oh, okay. You know, I'm definitely over see. comfort over everything. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we, we cozy girls. Yeah. We and do I feel like that's cozy. The, that's the beauty of fashion today is that it can be yeah, as like casual, or as formal is, as you want it, mm-hmm. you know? It's crazy. Like You how, can dress it up and down, too. That's the really craziest can. part about it. Like, yeah. I love that women, like, really be putting on, like, a blazer with biker shorts and exactly. sneakers. And, oh, they and really, it works. Yeah. And it works. It looks so cute. Fine. It works. Yeah. yeah, so. yeah. Basketball shorts, too. That have become oh, such yeah. a more, like, intertwined into, like, like, higher Don, fashion now. I feel now. like Don C started that. Oh, Don, yeah. Agree. Yeah. Agree. Yeah. Don started the doing Don, the Shout out to Don C. You know, four hundred dollars. I think I agree because Mitchell and Ness went to another level oh, when they yeah. started collaborating with oh, Don. Yeah. Absolutely, yeah. some of my short, favorite collabs. Quality. Like those yeah. ones are really heavy. They're really yeah. nice. I yeah. agree. And they started making women's cut ones too. That yes, are yes, I yeah, because we got a few. Yeah. We yeah. ourselves oh, have yeah, okay. have partaked in those. I got like a few pairs. Hell and yeah. they got it right too because it hugs your you know, body it's funny, the right way. Because at Jordan Brand, I always tell them that I want when I do trophy room shorts, I tell them to make the men's shorter because that's how you know my pops and them used to wear them back in the day. Yes, and they always they always rag on me because they <laughs> no. say like nah, no you but you too you're short. on to something right. though i'm like no, a know, lot of dudes are the yeah. six inch like MCs the are daddy done. Yeah, exactly. yeah. That's you know, four inches women you know, like that five, five at the most you know i feel like that's a sweet spot no I, I really like it is sell and yeah. women love the thighs okay yeah. and yeah. women also shop in men that's what i was about to get to so like i would buy that you feel me so absolutely yeah because, you know, a lot of men are in those extra smalls, but we'll go ahead and squeeze our ass in. And then be like, eh, let me squeeze my little ass. Oh, you know. Yeah. Um, okay, so what's your favorite silhouette? <sighs> that's a tough, you know, I, that's probably my most <laughs> asked question, most frequently Naturally. asked question. Mm-hmm. It's like having a favorite sibling. You know what I'm saying? You it can't, changes. You know, it, changes. Yeah, it changes. So if <laughs> I'm going to. That's fair. It's yeah. true. So if I'm going to hoop, I'm probably hooping in like. 
tens, elevens. Okay. Yeah, the new performer. Uh, like I just hooped okay. in the 38s the other day. Oh, okay. 38. Um, 38. Isn't that crazy? Right. It's crazy, there. right? Crazy. Wow. But if I was going to just kick it, like ones, okay. fours, fives. So like yeah. it just depends yeah. on the occasion. I agree. Okay. What's your you know? least favorite? Yes. Yeah. Mm. That's a great That's question. Like, oh, yeah. Wow. You or know, most uncomfortable, oh, too. Yeah. Least favorite. Man, like I'm not a big 15 person. Oh, you know, I kind of like I, the 15. No, I, look, I, I like them when I like bring them out on occasion. Yeah. But like mm. it's not like if I'm looking in my closet, that's my go-to. Oh yeah, you know, no. you know what? They are kind of hard to wear though. Yeah. Yeah. I will say that 100%. they're kind of hard it's to wear. It's like what do you you know? It's just mm -hmm. not, not my favorite. Not I, my yeah. favorite. No, they're yeah. very like hard to style. Wear they're better than men. Even when well, I got those yeah. Billy Eilishes, I was yeah. like, what the fuck? I'm yeah. actually a size 15 too, so I feel like when I put things on, it don't look the same. It's like a size nine, a size 12. Sure. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's that plays a factor too. Is it hard for you to find shoes? Luckily, I know a guy. Okay. <laughs> I know a guy. Luckily, I know a guy. You know. Duh. <laughs> Wait, I but I mean, 15 is still a big shoe. Yeah. A big, you know, it's hard yeah. to find. Yeah. It's hard to find dress yeah. shoes. But you know, luckily, I'm, I was yeah. watching I'm your full size run interview, okay. and you said you got the pair of the satin shutter backboards customized yeah. in your size. Oh, I did. You know, they're only in women's sizes. Yeah, yeah. 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 It so started with like a ten and a half or something. Yeah. yeah. So and I got a sixteen and a half. Oh my Jesus! Yeah, which is the and then I did a sixteen and a half in the off white muslin fours. Because they didn't, oh, they didn't have yeah, a I remember those. Exactly. And so I, wow. I, I, had, I don't like to, you know, make those calls. <laughs> but yeah, when there's you can't, though. Exactly. exactly. When there's a we shoe, don't blame you. If I could make the call, I would, too. Yeah, right? Exactly. Mm -hmm. Shout out Marie Williams, too, because Marie hooked me up with those. Oh, so. okay. Yep. 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 Hi, Marie. <laughs> <laughs> what up, girl? Come on the pie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, you talked about, like, collabs and, yep. like, having the store so that it collabs better or the other shoe collaborations not you know, really intertwining with like your dad's le legacy and yeah. stuff. So how do you feel about like other people collabing <laughs> on like Jordan shoes? Yeah. So when I was younger, I used to feel a type of way really? just because I was like, yo, you know, it all started with my dad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you're going to be, if you're going to, you know, be granted the opportunity to collab on mm -hmm. one, especially one through 14. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, anything after that, like, you know, you could try to eat heat. <laughs> Have I mean, fun. You could try mm -hmm. to add yeah. energy to it, but, yeah. you know, good luck. And so that's one of the reasons why I started with the 17 and mm, did the okay. 16 mm -hmm. too. To the 23 I started, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. in terms of trophy room. But um, nowadays I feel okay about it, you know, just because, mm -hmm. like, Number one, it's carved a lane out for me. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. But, uh, you know, I also feel like the brand is trying to grow their reach, you know? True. And so, and plus, when the collaborator gets that opportunity, they want to tell a story that's true to them. Yeah. True. And obviously, everybody has a connection to my dad in some sort of way. Yeah. But I feel like, you know, when most collaborators get the opportunity, they want to tell their story. Yeah. So, true. You know, my opinion on that has evolved. Yeah. But, uh, you know, I'm... I'm still authentic to who I am and my dad's legacy, yeah, you know? Yeah. I like that, yeah. though. Yeah. 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 Can I, like I ask Sidebar? And if I know it's not on here, but if you don't want it, we could edit okay. it. No, you got <laughs> it. You got it's it. It's something crazy. I was just like, how do you feel about the success of, like, the Travis Scott Jordans? No, I love Travis. Travis yeah. is my man, you okay. know? And so I think, you know, he's one of the few people that can, like, move the culture forward. Right. Yeah. And so, like, him right. and obviously, rest in peace, Virgil. Virgil yeah. Of course. Dudes, you know? And so... You know, you can't hate on what they've yeah, done because they also, you know, add a, add their own spin on it yeah. and bring a uniqueness to they it. They both Definitely. reset the culture, if we yeah. really think Definitely. about right. it. Like, they both did. Within, like, Jordan yeah. collabs, those are some of, like, the biggest ones. And yeah. you can't leave out my mentor, James, either. James Yo, is always... I'm we have this conversation yeah. all the time. I'm, I'm in here. I always got something <laughs> yeah. in the back. The three so is the one week. of the best shoes I've ever that owned. That three is amazing. Yeah. It's and so it was amazing. a women's shoe that even makes... It's beautiful. That three is... Shout out to you, James. Yeah, yeah. I got, shout I out to, to you. you know, that's my. Yeah. I learned the ropes from James. Yeah, so I had we to, we know, had like a few episodes back. We were talking because the ships came oh, out. Yeah. The airships. Like, oh, James will pull favorite. up too. Don't, don't oh, get it twisted. Well, look, James. He'll pull up. Like, James, he don't please. get out to the West Coast much, but, but when he does, pull up. Yeah. I, I, yeah. please pull up, sir, because he be dropping gems. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm a connect capital, all capital gems. Okay, every single shoe has been. Really great, yeah. like honestly, yeah. like none of them have really been a miss. Yeah. Yeah. There hasn't honestly, been a miss. Yeah. There has not they're been not bad. one miss. Dropping soon, no. The, the have they dropped fives are dropping. Yeah, I feel the women's yeah, ones. Fives, the yeah. women's oh. fives. The women's yes. fives. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Those fives are fire. I feel like before the end of the year, right? Yeah. Yeah. Am I tripping? Because we talked about him. Yeah. He's getting a seventeen. 
Yeah, and we've talked, we talked about, about if, he's, that. if he's getting the case with the if, 17. Yeah, for, if we're getting the I know, yo, they did me dirty when I dropped the yeah. 17. That's why we're like, to, is there a case? Exactly. I don't think no cases are coming with any of the yeah. stuff that's I coming. Mean, I think I there might think be so. one inline case that makes its way. I don't know, but is well, I keep that, that same me. energy with these small sizes because yeah, right? we want one. Yeah. Right? Yes. Like, don't yeah. don't let below seven. Yeah. Even though I'm a seven, if I don't get a case, it's gonna be a problem. Shout out James though. They in their bag. I'm a millionaire. Social status. All of them. So okay. So. So far with your store and everything, like what's the biggest lesson you've learned in your business journey? Um, you know, the biggest lesson that I've learned, I feel like is just to attack every day, you mm-hmm. know, like, like almost like it's on the court for me. Yeah. And so, because you only get a limited amount of time mm-hmm. on this earth, you know? And yeah. so I feel like you got to wake up every day with the mindset of I'm going to attack this day and, and seize the day. So yeah. I think that's the biggest lesson that I've learned. So like day yeah. by day, basically. Yeah. Yeah. I live very much so in the present, <laughs> you know? So. I mean, that's what you're supposed to do, though. Yeah. That's how but you really capture shit. But it's hard because when, you, when you're designing stuff, it's like oh, yeah. you're 16, so far 18, out. 18 months Here's out. You know? So yeah. far out. So it's, you know. And it's really hard like, true. to predict trends. Like, come, you know, like, we talk about like, this often. Right we now, talk about like, this often. A year and a half, two years from now, is like people it can be hit or miss. A lot of people miss. That's why our main, we we always go back to this conversation, but we always talk about the Tiana Taylor Jordan that yeah. came out recently mm. and what did y'all think about that so we all are on the same page <laughs> yeah, no. it, it was a miss it was <laughs> it was okay. bef- it should have been released like that type of design and this is, goes back to well, what and you were saying and it was a one com- zoom comfort hot yeah but yeah. It can be Zoom comforts can yeah, still be done right. Right. Yeah. 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 It can be done right. Yeah. A lady, yeah. a lady yeah. killed us. Yeah. 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 Shout out to a lady. Yeah, that that color Shout blocking out to is simple. It wasn't overdone. It just, I think for us, we said time and time again that that shoe. Frank had his hand on that too, and you could tell. Cooker always cooking. You know, you feel me? Shout out Frank. Come on the pod. He's supposed to be coming on the pod. He's you Uggs sidebar. Yeah, thank you for my Uggs, Frank. Love you. Yeah, hell yeah. Uggs are dope. I like that brown colorway mm. you like totally the brown. i like the blue the I best like the blue the blue is nice but that yeah. brown is really i like a brown. okay, a neutral. okay. but um, why don't you ain't send none to elena and janelle you know better i'm a come on now yeah, cook, i'm waiting on my package yeah. Yeah. Lord, 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 Lord. Lord. where's our shoes exactly What's come on that? now <laughs> He's going to be like, Henny, shut the fuck <laughs> up. He's literally going to come in my DMs and yeah, be like, you're crazy, shut up. That's up. That's I'm up. dead. I completely forgot what you were talking about. No? <laughs> uh, no, nah, it was my biggest well, lesson. Yes, my biggest lesson. Oh, that's yeah. right. But yeah. I love it. Good outlook. <laughs> <Thank you. laughs> No, we were talking about the Tianas. Oh, that's yeah. all oh that's true, 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 No, true, we, were talking, true. we were talking about true. something important. But I think that would have, like, definitely 2013, that shoe would have been a fucking Or even when, a, uh, not lately, but when Mel dropped her stuff. Oh, say, that part that you went to with Blue, yeah. when they did the, the mids. What was the, oh, fearless? Yeah, the Fearless? The Fearless. Oh, the Fearless. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm like, still upset those blues didn't come in small Dude, size. Dude, we ain't even want to have that I conversation. Mean, those, we're not going to have those yeah. conversations. Yeah. They, I That's such a great shoe. It was yeah. the smallest size it's a great as far shoe. as I know. That's and that was five. such a good sh- I yeah. love that yeah. shoe. But to your point, yeah. how you were talking about how, like, you have to design so far out. You do. You have to think about, like, where the culture is going to be when that shoe drops. It's mm-hmm. funny because, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. Oh, no, 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 no. no. But we I do it to each other all the time. But I just say that to say that with the Tiana stuff, I think where her head was or whoever was helping her like consult with that they knew at that time that that was hot but mm-hmm. when it drops in 2023 like things move so quickly and it just wasn't hitting the same yeah, yeah even with her yeah. story and harlem ate it up like i'm so glad yeah. her city fucked with her oh, on yeah. that yeah. but it just would have been great if the whole nation and honestly we've said this before that jacket was hella expensive who's spending oh, 700 yeah. on that jacket on a yeah. i know that i, know. I, get, I, I feel get like it. price is going up for everything i'll say yeah. time and time well, this again is true. we just weren't this the demographic true. for that jacket yeah, there yeah. is a demographic it's, it wasn't yeah, that's totally true. Fun. so especially when the lady jacket was only 250 storytelling yeah because you know mm-hmm. if you tell the story in a way where you understand the value of why this jacket exactly is mm-hmm. then it's like People you know eat it, up. it makes sense and what i was going to say is that uh you know, with Trophy Room, it's, you have to design in the future, but also I'm pulling stories from the past. Right. Yeah. You know? But that's so a win, though. Automatic. I'm very, for- yeah. I'm very fortunate yeah. that I'm allowed to, you know, yeah. tell the stories that I can tell. But, but I think that's why the Trophy Rooms hit so hard when they yeah. came out, because people were it was so so nostalgic. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? And, oh, yeah. and the concept as well. Like, who is doing, like, a right? frosted shoe? Like, you know? yeah. you- it, But at the time when we were designing it, I was like, you know, is it risky? Because, mm. you know... Are people going to want to put a, yeah. a glittery, because people like call it glittery, a shiny one, like, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Exactly. So, Hell yeah. But I think, again, it goes back to storytelling. We mm-hmm. told a unique story yeah. around the freeze out, and it made sense. People love it. 
And it was one of the first shoes we saw come back with like a vintage aged look. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I literally feel like this is what set it off. Like, because now we see a lot of like newer shoes come out with the the vintage, like aged look. But this is the first one. If you really think about it. Mm -hmm. True. Exactly. Well, and Virgil, too, with the off Yeah, Chicago. Virgil, yeah. Virgil. Yes. I mean, he deconstructed the whole thing. But it just, yeah, know? it was just different with Virgil because there were so many more elements. Yeah, You yeah, know yeah. what it I mean? Was, it was, yeah, exactly. True. All right, well, do you have any, like, favorite things that you like about sneakers? Um, or, like... In the current moment. The current, yeah, yeah. yeah. like the times right now. You know, I I like the fact that it is so much parody around mm. sneakers. Like, okay. there's just, it's it's a little oversaturated. Mm-hmm. Oh, know? yeah, we talked about that, too. I, I'm not going <laughs> to, you know, sugarcoat it, but I do think that from a design standpoint, it challenges you to make meaningful product. Right. You know what I'm saying? And, and so, you know, I think that's my favorite thing right now is that every time I sit down to try to create something, I'm trying to make sure that it can stand the test of time and mm-hmm. that it's, like, impactful, you know? Yeah, yeah. So, agreed. Classics. Yeah. Even if you catch up to it late, you know, because I yeah. feel like the sevens, people, I feel like people slept on the sevens a little yeah. bit. Mm-hmm. But once you get them in hand and, you know, if you got the apparel or whatever, it's like, all right, I, can, I get it. I dig yeah. it. But so the beautiful thing about that, not to cut you off, but the beautiful thing about that is, like, we were always saying, like, our sneaker um, taste is evolving. Mm-hmm. Yes. Like, we may, you know, tomorrow I might be like, you know what, I'm a seven girl. Right. I, w- mm-hmm. I want all the fire sevens. And then I, then I start searching and yep. then boom. Yep. So that's what I love about Jordan Brand is that, I can just go back in time and just pick whatever I yeah. want at any given time. Yep. So I think it'll age well regardless. And I feel I like agree. Jordan Brand made that cool. You know, agree. Yeah. Yeah. Agree. Like I, I just feel like the the catalog is so extensive mm-hmm. that it's like, all right, like you said, you get a, a sixteen or a seventeen for the first time, an eighteen for the first time. It's like, damn, I got to go back and grab. Yeah. All of them, oh, yeah. You know? It really makes you so, want to like. It really does. You know. Yeah. Go in depth. Um, we obviously we kind of already talked about trophy room and stuff, but yeah. what really made you want to start a store, open a yeah. store? Yeah. yeah, because it's. That's I mean, I've worked me. at stores. You yeah. worked at a store yeah. like retail stores. Like it's a lot. It's a lot to, <laughs> oh, to do with. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, for me, it's just because I grew up around you know Jordan Brand my entire yeah. literally my entire literally. life. Literally, <laughs> so it's like it just made the transition seamless. Mm. And you know, for me, I wanted to open up a store where I could kind of merge you know, Jordan, Nike, and then also streetwear as well. Mm-hmm. And so it just kind of gave me a purpose to be at Paris at Fashion Week. Right, and like right. Go to Tokyo <laughs> to meet yeah. with Bape and like mm-hmm. Mastermind and all these Dumb, brands, you yeah. know. And so, we love to see it. you know, that was part of it. But at the same time, it was just like, you want to do what you love. And mm-hmm. I grew up loving sneakers and so in fashion. So it's like, all right, bet, I'm here. Yeah, <laughs> you I love know? that. Let's just do it. Hand in hand. Yeah. But I love that, you know, you took it upon yourself to open a store though, yeah. because yeah. you know, there's so many other routes you could have went with that. Yeah. And yet you s- chose to stay in like a neighborhood community and like serve your neighborhood. Nah, look, and, I th- and, and I fuck with that. And it wasn't easy. Honestly, one of the reasons that made my dad, you know, comfortable was that I was opening at Disney world originally. Mm-hmm. Really? That made him comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cause, yeah. Cause at, at that Disney? time I was 25 years old and it, it was like, you never Ran a store. You uh, never yeah. worked at He wanted me to go intern with James at, oh. at Social Staff. Oh, okay. wow. And I told him, I was like, look, I'm not interning. At <laughs> you said, look here. Yeah, this is before no. I met James. This is before I met James. Oh, but I was okay. like, look, I'm not interning somewhere that's selling my dad's shoes. Like, yeah. no, nah, right. uh-uh. And then it was actually Carrie Connor at Jordan Brand at the time who mm-hmm. introduced me to James. And she was like, no, look, just talk to this guy. He knows what he's doing, blah, 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 blah. And then once I met James, it was like, ah, oh, we, we were like brothers. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So. Uh, he kind of taught me the ropes. I, you know, he was like mentored me a little bit, and so that's kind of what helped my dad be at ease with <laughs> yeah. you know, me doing because do it. it was you know. Okay. And then at the same time, it was like, look, if you want to do this, I had a trust set aside that he was like, all right, put some skin in the game. Mm-hmm. And so I kind of liquidated a trust to start Trophy Room. Nice. Not a lot of people know that they yeah. think like yeah. it was just oh, you know, yeah, whatever. You know, yeah, 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 exactly. It was like I had to you know, put some skin in the game also. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, so. I, I fuck with that. Yeah. yeah. He yeah. said, Disney backing you up. Okay. Right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay I originally, guess. Originally, now yeah. we got the right. foot traffic. I right. see what's right. going yeah. on here. Yeah. Oh, they be busy over there. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> but it was, it was constant. Like, all right, business plan development. He would have questions. Oh, what about this? What about that? I go to James. Like, James, all right, what do you got to do? What do you got to do? What's going on? You know what I'm saying? So, no, nah, it was like a two-year journey. 
to yeah. get it open. And now what, it's, we've been open What year did years. it open up, you said? We, so we started working on it early 2015. Okay. We, oh, we wow. launched May 23rd, 523, which five oh, is my okay, number. Yeah. Boom. 2016. Okay. And so we just celebrated our seven-year anniversary. Oh, wow. Nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. But obviously, we Time did three years at Disney. Disney, we transitioned out of there just because we couldn't grow with the rate we I'm wanted so to. I'm mad I didn't know that because I would have went yeah, to Disney World was, just to go yeah. to the store. Man. No, a lot of people I just, did. Man. A lot, I never go to Disney A lot of people did. And I then through COVID, it was like a blessing in disguise because we were online only for two and a half years. Uh, yeah. yeah. And so I got the chance to A lot to of kinda, stores were, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, it just worked out. We closed Disney June of 2019. And then wow. fast forward, March of 2020, COVID happened. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it was like... Literally adjusting. blessing in, this, in disguise. <laughs> yeah. And so it gave me two and a half years to kind of set the business up for longer term success. And so now, I'm, you know, we got a year and a half under our belt at okay. the new location and we're ready to start rocking and rolling. At know? the second location. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. exactly. Okay. I'm That's not awesome. mad. Um, so, okay. Oh, interesting question for okay. us, for the women. Where would you like to see Women's Jordan in the future or like sneakers in general for women? You know, I feel like Jordan Brand is doing a great job investing in. To women. The women are doing a lot right now. I agree. Yeah. And yeah. I feel like that's been an initiative for them for the longest, for mm -hmm. at least like the past five years. Mm -hmm. For her. For her. Yes, exactly. for, for her. her. That's yeah. like, yeah. The, yeah. exactly. This and this for her. Yeah. 100%. And so, you know, I think one, Jordan brand apparel for women has come a long way. Oh, it has yeah. evolved. Yeah. I agree. You know? I remember so, the first collection. Yeah. And yes. so, I mean, obviously not to shrink it and pink it, you know, <laughs> yes. I feel like they're yes. evolving from that, but mm -hmm. I think there's a tremendous amount of growth opportunities for Jordan brand. Yeah. Yes. And I feel like they're knocking it out the park. Is there you any know? like women's Jordan stores specifically, like exclusively? I don't no. think so. Not yet. No, that would be a dope Not concept. Because there's only the like three standalone stores, yeah. right? It's yeah. Chicago, yeah. New York, and LA. Yeah. Well, yeah. I think they tried the retail thing and then they kind of pivoted away from it because they had the side by side doors with foot action or whatever. Oh, okay, oh, yeah, got, yeah, it, yeah. got it, got Even it. The LA it. one is a, a foot, locker. foot locker. Yeah, yeah. exactly. True. So, but I do think that a woman's only store in the future could. Could happen. There's some. Yeah. In, there's some Nike that would be stores great. like that too. So. Yeah. Oh yeah, there are. Absolutely. Yeah. They just so. open one out here. There's opportunity yeah. for it too. They're yeah. There's yeah. definitely opportunity for I it. I wouldn't rule it out. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's okay. possible. I know something. I don't know shit. I don't work for <laughs> yeah, What you trying to tell us? I'm yeah. independent. I don't work for <laughs> okay. I'm just, I'm a Jason. I'm synonymous is what I like True. to say. I'm synonymous. Um, piggybacking off of that, like, would you ever consider doing, like, a women's trophy room, Jordan? Absolutely. 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 We would love yeah, it. Would love oh, to, yeah. Okay. Know, and hopefully, you know, fingers crossed, something's in the works. Yeah, down, that would be really cool. We would love to see it, yeah. Yeah. to be honest. Yeah, that would be really there. cool. First, first step is to you know take it down to women's sizes. Yes. Yeah, exactly. just okay, yeah, baby steps. We'll take yeah. the baby yeah. steps. Yeah. You know, yeah. I'm all about the That's journey. Fine. I'm all yeah. about the journey. I get know? it. And like we said, it takes a long time to get this stuff going. Yeah. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then anything else? We've asked you a few things, but anything else upcoming you can talk about that we haven't mentioned? <sighs> Nah, I man. Ah, okay. All, okay. All eyes focus on this on this one low. Yeah. You know? Okay. And, no, that's dope, though. We looking yeah. forward to it. The yeah, campaign is going to be serious. Yeah. The story okay. is serious. You know, y'all. I think y'all will like it. I okay. Hope. okay. We're crossed. looking forward to it. No, we are. Yeah. Yeah. But we are starting to work on the next one because you know the longer the lead time, yeah. the more mm -hmm. you can do with it. So that's okay. I can't say what it is yet, though. Okay. Yeah. So I think that's all the questions we have for now. Um. But so, yeah. Thank you for all that. Of course. Yeah. Of course. Yes. I appreciate, appreciate you Thanks it. for having me. Yeah. yeah. So we're going to get into our unboxing questions before we wrap it up. And this week we asked, what's one sneaker you never thought you'd have in your collection that you now own? Yes. So for me, it would probably be, okay, these, obviously, <laughs> <Come on. laughs> you know. Now. Right. <laughs> right. Well, they exactly. are. Um, but also my 94 uh, black cement threes. Oh, okay. yeah. So those are just Good sentimental. One. And yeah. this pair I didn't think I was going to get yet. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Um, okay, probably hurts. my Nike Easy 2s, the plaques. Mm. Yeah. That is a good one. It is a good one. I've had it since, like, 2016. But still, like, oh. thinking about it, like, I still can't believe, like, I have, like, a Nike Easy in my yeah. size. Like, That's what's up. I've yeah. I, uh, for me, I think it was, you know, the off-white Chicago's that Virgil gifted my dad. Mm -hmm. So I was at my dad's house one day and he was, you know, I was, this was before I opened, I think Disney. And he was like, you know, I was tugging on his coattails. I'm like, yo, I need some shoes. I need some shit to put in the, to the, put in the shop. And he what was like, yo, I, I know, he was like, you know, I ain't have these. Right. And so he brought them out 
and I didn't think he would let me take them. And oh. so essentially I, I have the personally gifted oh, wow. off white Chicago's from Virgil to my dad wow. in my possession. So I'd say that's, that's, that's probably nice. Are they still yeah. dead sock or have that, you no, worn them? Okay. Not. I can't yeah. Fit I was them. like, yeah. Yeah. no, oh, they're in pristine sense. shape oh. Oh, okay. and you know, they're in a, a very, very safe and secluded. Yeah. Place, you know, that's 100%. amazing. Having yeah, that is. Temperature. Yeah. Yeah. No, they, they come yeah. right. percent. <laughs> wow. And I can't remember what it is, but on the, Oh, I think it was the inspiration. So he said, Virgil inscribed it and basically said, thanks for all the inspiration. He, oh, spelled, wow. he spelled inspiration wrong. Ah, oh, my God. You know, God. it's okay. It's okay. It happens, it happens. Play us fuck up, too. I see a picture of I know, I'll send y'all a picture. Yeah, I, I, I got a picture okay, somewhere. Yeah. I got a picture post somewhere. It, but <laughs> but, <laughs> but that's just how authentic, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Right. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. And he does it in marker, right? Yeah, like, yeah that fire. like big black yeah. permanent marker. Yeah. 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 Air Jordan on the on the midsole and all of that shit. That's dope. That's so funny. Yeah, that's a good one. That actually is pretty funny. Yeah. What about you, Hen? Um, oh, shit. Probably my CPFM. That's in Sar- my head. Sararski. In my head, yeah. I'm just like, if you don't say those yeah, things, yeah. Because that's my, I'm like. Y'all don't know what I had to do to get that shoe, man. I want like, that shoe. One of these things you're going to have to tell us, because you said that the last yeah. episode. Yeah, too. man. I, I'm, <laughs> look, if I ever get married, that's the shoe I'm getting married that's in. I want to get married in. Yeah, that's the shoe I'm getting married one. in. And I want that olive one. That olive one is fire. No, the olive one, oh, that, yeah. girl, girl, one day. That's what's one up. One day. I don't know yeah. what shoe I'd get married in. I would get married in that one. That was so pretty. Yeah, yeah. I, you know, I'm, you know, a wedding is in my horizon potentially. So oh. I, might be, I might be looking for some sneakers to wear okay. too. You know what I'm is this another leak of the week? <laughs> is this a leak of the week? <laughs> leak of the week. Leak of the week. Yeah, leak of the week. <laughs> Shout out, Bay. Shout out, Lexa. <laughs> exactly. Uh, all right, let's read off yeah, some, let's read some of some our answers. responses. Let's see what y'all got. Let me see. Okay, Off we had white, a lot of people. Nike, one? lot four. Got them right before Virgil passed. Oh. Okay. That's a sentimental one. I know. I don't know the lot. I can't remember. Yeah, the I'm like. With the one? colors. Oh, yeah. those. Okay. The, dunk, the different colors. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah I, I got even. the twos right before he passed. I did so. too. Yeah, like I days. remember you yeah. I Literally like days. Days before, days he, before passed, he passed. And then like yeah. the price went up. Yeah, shit crazy. Yeah. yeah. Um, oh, Char said Tiffany Dunk Lowe's. That's a good one. Okay. Shout That's a good Char. one. Yes. That is um, a good one. Reverse skunk dunks. Okay. I'm like, <laughs> I'm trying to think of I some of these collections like, that's different. One? That's what I, I'm trying to like think of it in my mind right now. Yeah, um, we'll pull up the photo. Drea, shout out Drea Plums. Oh, okay. still dead stock from the trauma of not getting them till two decades after. I mean, OG plums are release. good, especially when they came back. Like, yeah, I'm not mad with plums. Someone said twelve cherry twelves. What? <laughs> <laughs> What year? I mean, they're bu- hey. they're literally coming they're out in holiday. Yeah. They're year. coming out in holiday. There's well, gotta be some sentimental value. Yeah, yeah. They, but the, yeah, definitely has to be a sentimental it thing because I said be never thought it. Yeah, no shade. I'm sorry yeah. if I if I came <laughs> off a certain I'm way. Sorry. Um, someone said Yeezys in their size US 16, but I want to know is it Nike? What, is it Nike or Adidas? Because Adidas, Adidas don't matter. <laughs> Only Nike Yeezy matters. <laughs> Yeezys in a US 16 though. That's it's crazy, right? It's gotta be Nikes. I would assume. I mean, unless it's like a turtle. No, because Adidas be coming out. With them big ass sizes, yeah, so yeah, like, yeah. Um, someone said off white fives. Fire. Okay. Which ones though? Yeah, the that's black, a good question. The yeah. The sales. yeah, I like the well, black ones better than the really sales. Free? Personally, yeah. I wear the black huh? ones more, but like, I definitely saving the sale ones for like. Okay, it's like you know, a special I, occasion. I haven't type even thing. worn the sale ones actually. Yeah. Yet, okay, but like one day I will. Okay, you know? I haven't worn my sale fours yet. Either. You haven't worn yourself for yet? I haven't worn mine I either. haven't. I caught I them. A, Beat mine. Oh, yeah, shit. I, I don't have a pair. <laughs> <laughs> what? You don't have that shoe? No. I caught them on one. like the shock drop. Larsa's got a pair. On yeah, sneakers. That's, that's she hasn't worn hers yet either. That's yeah. a good yeah. thing. <laughs> I, I, and honestly, like I haven't seen like my size. Like I would want like in good condition. At oh, right. Yeah. Point. Like yeah. But when they're beat, they're they, no, be mine's are beat. Beat. They be yeah. ugly. They be but like you gotta wear your kicks, though. You I agree, them. but take care of them. Yeah, I'll wear them agree. eventually. They go <laughs> hand in hand. Take care of them. <laughs> Especially true. if you want to resell. Don't be like beating your shoes up and be, like trying to resell them for high. Yeah. 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 Like, like that's just rude. Yeah. Um, OG 1985 blue metallics. Fire. 
I believe. Really? Is that your friend? Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. I see. Not it, yeah. your friend. Your friend posted that. Stop it's my it. friend. Yeah, <laughs> Damien. Um, <laughs> of course, think, Damien, you post this. Yeah, well, I think he got these in Tokyo. I can't remember if it was last year or like a few okay. years back, but he got those Man, in Tokyo. He got everything. But those, like, at skit. Come on the pod. Does, does he have the whole collection? No, not oh, all the does. colors. Yeah, no, he don't have all the whole collection. Oh, okay. No. Yeah. I'm trying to think of if this is the only color he has or if he has another one. But oh, I want to say he got these from Skit out in Tokyo. So, oh, cool. Um, Off White Brooklyn. Air- Virgil, That's the green ones. Air Force yeah. Ones. Was it the green ones? The green. Oh, yeah. Okay. I don't I have those. I have everything okay. except those. I had the blue Momo joints and somebody rocked. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have. What? They stole them? Well, I was, they were stealing? No, nah, I, I move a lot. And okay. So I lost them in my move somehow. Somebody stole that. Somebody they, stole them. That's, you I'm don't thinking. lose that that's shoe. They were stealing in your size at that. And, and yeah. honestly, one of Who my boys, shout out Javon oh. Coney. Javon Coney got them for me, and I had them, and I never rocked them, and oh. they came up missing. Nothing Somebody, stealing. Wow. I, know, I know. If we I know. ever see a fifteen, yeah, 15 in those, yeah. we're gonna be we like, know. Yeah, where are these coming from? Because I wear fourteen in Air Force. Oh yeah, because they were the size big. Yeah. Oh yeah. Air Force ones. I got on a fourteen. Just because. I'm gonna be side eyeing anybody. In a 14 right. wearing those. Exactly. What are those? What size are them? Where'd you get those at? Trust me. Um, what else? Atmos Air Max One Elephant. That's a good one. That I wish is a good I had one. That um, Red Sixteens. Red. Are they saying 2016? Nah. I hope not. Talking I about don't the know. The, the okay, I was about to say. The the black and red ones, right? Yeah. The fifteens. Yeah. Okay. 16. They said sixteen. No, sixteen. All black oh. with the shroud with the Yep. With got, the you. Okay. got you. Got you, got That's you, got you. That's what I'm assuming. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um ninety nine Air Jordan fourteen mid Carolina. Signed by Tinker. Wow. Yeah. That's fire. Are those oh, the patent leather Jordan? No, 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 no. Those aren't the patent leather. The patent Signed leather ones are two thousand three. The remember? patent leather ones? No, the mids, the mid. one mids, North the Carolina. They, you remember it was a North Carolina, he said he said or Chicago. He oh, said, I thought he, he said, said one. one. My bad. But he's saying the ninety nine uh, Air Jordan fourteen. Wouldn't that be a low? That's what's up. A okay, low. okay, got it. Or is that a regular fourteen? 14. No, because there is like some fourteen. There's low. a mid fourteen. Uh, no, there oh. are. Yeah. Oh, I'm thinking there low. Is. There, I thought it goes low, mid, high with them. On the 14? On the 14? On the 14 it's was already, already a mid low. cut. It was a mid okay, so cut, and then you got the low. The I think you got a low and a mid. Four, okay, a say less. though, I because they're got, already. I think you got a. Yep, you have the low, then you have the, the mid. mid. Yeah, it's already, it's already, already the mid. Because the but, mids come up like the, like the ladies that just came out. Those are the mids, yeah, right? Yeah, it's already a mid. Exactly. He's talking about the Carolinas, the white with the So they're already mid. So he's just talking about a regular 14? It got to be because <laughs> there's only two sides. Because that's the mid right there. The one that's right there. Put Carolina. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. Put the actual shoe talking about because. I think it's going to be all white with the Carolina yeah. blue shark teeth. Now, why these ones got to come up? Put no put, mid. I'm telling you. Don't put you. mid. Put 14 yeah, just Carolina blue. Yeah, throwing us off. Yeah. We gotta, this is why we got Google. Those exactly uh, the white joints with the with the blue shark. Exactly. Uh, okay, that's okay. a low. This that's not like a mid. Low. Is it a low? That's a low. It's it's like be a low. low. What the fuck? So then he low. meant low. He had to have meant low. Yeah, because oh that's no. a, that's definitely a low. That's not the mid. I clicked on something and it fucked me up. No, nah, it's right there. It I was thought right there. We, we seen it. Okay, it was on the bottom right. Yeah, but I don't want. I was like, I don't want to click Spam. on spam. Yeah. 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 <laughs> 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 Y'all ain't going to be in my business. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> don't, don't touch anything. <laughs> that's just like, what ad did I click on? Uh, okay. Yeah, this is like, okay. this is wait, a no, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. That's the low. That's the low. low. Exactly. Okay, so that's I'm the, pretty sure he That's the low. low. But this one, sure. he'll correct us because he'll watch and listen. It's the low. Yeah. <laughs> that's the low. But okay. signed by Tinker, that's nice. That's yeah. crazy. Where were you to get right. that to happen? Who was that, yeah, actually? We, sneaker fetish? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you be moving to be from Alabama, my guy. Yeah, like, you be out in these yeah. streets. Okay. <laughs> I'm not mad at it. Um, it was splatter dunk lows. What? Is there two splatter colors or no? Oh, that I don't know. I love to see the engagement, though. Yeah, that we, yeah. A lot of people be angry. People fuck with us. Yeah, I'm telling cool. you, they fuck with us. I love it. That's what's up. Um, Y'all posted people, this today? Yeah. 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 Really this morning. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's what's up. Um, some, oh, kind of recent. Born and raised dunks. I get it. Due to what happened. Same. Yeah. I want them really bad. Yeah. I still want those. Someone hook me up with a fucking seven. 
I'll pay. What did you buy for Syndicate the other day? I saw something in your bag. Oh, I got my um nephew the Albino Preto Dunks SB. Oh, okay. They got have, it. My nephew. Not me in your business. No, but it's like, okay. My nephew. The jiu jitsu. Ones? Yeah, the jiu jitsu. Yeah. Ones. They're super cute. They had a nine and a half. This kid is 11. He's wearing a nine and a half. Man. Wow. He going like, to be tall. Dang. I was like, okay. He's wearing a nine, nine and a half. So I picked those up for him. Oh, okay. nice. Um, Off White MCA Air Force One. That's exactly. Yeah. Mm. You know? It's a good one. Is that the one I have? Is that the yellow one? Am I tripping? That's or the yellow. That's yeah, the that's yellow the one joint. I have. Yeah, nah, I have the yellow one. The Momo ones. was yeah. the blue joint. Yes. Yeah, correct. Uh, New Balance 550. Not the. Excuse me? Is she <laughs> trolling us? She's trying to be funny. Sure this this is Jordan's all girl. 15, Who? Now I'm obsessed. Um, uh, well, I. Please tell me her name. Oh, I, Tasha. Thank you. Yes. Okay, Tasha, you lying. She Stop the it. That's why I was like, she spelled the difference. Tasha being wrong. funny. Don't um, don't <laughs> Tasha. First shoe I ever tweaked over Sean Witherspoon Air Max. Mm. Good Nike Air Yeezy Two that Solar. A That's a good one. Um, Syndicate Vans. Not the Syndicate Van. Oh, Syndicate right. had a van. They did. Yeah, they did. I yeah. like that van a lot. I don't think. Shout out to them. Nah. You it's should. A, you should yeah, visit. Syndicate's a dope store. It's in Chinatown. Yeah. It's a resale. One of the only resale stores you do they, should they ever visit. They don't do visit. consignment. They just do. Yeah, I don't buy really. It, so. I don't really be in the resale store. Yeah. yeah. Well. It's more so. They're, it's a very more of a community. I don't blame you. First of all, I'm not buying shit. Oh yeah, no. But like, pop in. Yeah. No, you know, I'll I'll pop in. They do like merch and shit. Like their merch is fire. When Sean had um round two on Melrose, and like he had the store not in round two, but like the one with all the vintage art. Vintage round two, vintage. Yeah. No, I never, I never really been in there either. Yeah. My boy was a big round two guy. Yeah. Okay. I never really. Okay. <laughs> don't, don't hold if it If you're ever you. in Chinatown, I mean, you yeah. don't really have a reason to yeah. go to a retail you know shop. Like, why, like oh, I, I need I think these. it's part of the culture, though. It now. is. No, it is so. part of it. Can, it's can a necessary, we ask how you feel about retail? It's a necessary yeah, how do you evil. feel about it's it? It's a necessary evil of the game. I feel <laughs> like that's... <laughs> it is. I feel like that Which is it is. Like, it is. You're not wrong. It's a necessary evil. I don't hate on it, you know. People got to you know, get it how they get it. I agree. I love I pull I, up the syndicate, though. I ain't got no problem. Yeah, yeah. Shout out our guys at syndicate. Yeah, guys. They, they good people. Yeah, they good people. Sure. They good people. Sure. For I sure. agree, though. The resale market, it's a love-hate because I love that, like we said earlier, you can go back on archives and find mm-hmm. old shit that people have that they're selling. It's yeah. amazing, you know, mm-hmm. but then it sucks yeah. when you have bots, when you have people yeah. getting fucked up, when you people buying shoes just mm-hmm. to, like, on a come-up. So yeah. It's a, it's a necessary. It has evil. fucked up the game, you. for sure, to an mm-hmm. extent. It's, it's helped it, but helped it's fucked it up. Yeah. 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 It's it's True. literally a catch-22. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Thing, but... Yeah, well, thank you so, so much. Thank you. Yeah. 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 You don't awesome. understand. Like, we were all so nervous. We I know. Were like, uh, for what? We were we like, like, ah, I was like, I'll believe it when he yeah. pulls up. So yeah. I was like, yeah. 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 I'm here. I'm here. We it's did it. Really it, was, yeah. it was lit. Thank y'all for having me. Yeah, this was yeah, amazing. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. And y'all got to pull up the trophy room. Oh, say less. Make sure y'all get the one loads once it's approved. Five, six, seven. I got y'all. We got it on record. Yeah, we definitely have to. Y'all heard him. Y'all heard him. I don't know if we can get Janelle in an airplane to trophy room. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we'll make it happen. It's worth it. Disney World. I'm telling you. We got the fact. We got a fact check. We got a fact check. I'm telling you, Disney World's the Disneyland. Disneyland has got nothing on Disney World. I promise. I you. I promise. Disney World's I huge, promise. though. I've been one time. It's huge. That's what I'm saying. It's yeah. like massive. Come it's massive. I know. Disney's my home. Disneyland's my home. That's yeah. how hardcore yeah. she is. Nah, okay. I, I don't want to talk, talk shit. I'm on, I'm on a way turf right now. But yeah, thank you so much. We hope, like, maybe in the future, when the ones come out, if you want to come back on, we'd love to have you again. Yeah, next door open. Yes. Yeah, we can do that too. Yes. We'll do a podcast episode out of there. Hell yeah. We love to go to the new location. Let's yeah. do it. Let's okay. Um, All of our ads. Oh, yes. Yeah, so don't forget to follow us on Instagram, Stinky Link Podcast. We have now hit 1K. 1,000 followers. Yes. Oh. Accomplishments. Um, and if you're watching us on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe on there, Sneaky Link Pod. Yes. Um, and listening to us, spot a Spotify and Apple Podcast. Yes. And we are now on, on TikTok. TikTok. Officially Finally. on TikTok. It's popping. It We're having good laughs. Yes. yes. About and to push out more funny content. Yes. And tune into TikTok this week just because we're going to compare the 2016 satins on there to the women's that just dropped today because yes. we didn't have time on this episode. So tune in. I believe the TikTok is the Sneaky Leak Pod. Correct. Yes. So, but thank you guys again. Thank you, of course. Thank you. Thank y'all. Yes.